Hello. Red Dead Redemption Zombie Pack. This is uh this is I'm Daniel. Tyler. We're uh we are going to be doing Let's Play Let's do it. Red Dead Redemption Undead Nightmare. Zombie Pack. Let's put it. Okay. Let's get to work. Okay. Now this is the opening cutscene. It's rather scary, a little spooky. There's a lot of um a lot of mixed emotions. John Marston has returned and, uh, to his loved ones. Well tried ah! his ranch and went back to the trust that of his family. <laughs> Marston awaits whatever life. Can I just say there were some Pinocchio trees back there that I think were quite a to throw at I saw that. I saw As he I drives think. home one evening from an errand, he ponders whether a man this can is have to escape you. his past gameplay footage. He That's definitely true. Who is ready for anything. No, no, no. Can if you just pause right here? Right. Um. This is going to be a very important thing. I'd like to point out that you can never ride the train. You can't, but it's very important that you remember that because that plays a significant role in the zombies. It's true. Yep. Almost anything. <laughs> Almost anything. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, oh! Just also, for the record, I've never seen, I've never seen a zombie put me yet. I play this game extensively, inside and out. I've never seen one. I agree. I'm just disappointed. <laughs> you have to ask me to step away. Okay, so starting out, we're just gonna go ahead and skip some of these scenes because you can find those yourself. You're probably already playing if you're watching this video. Blah 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 blah. Your family gets infected. Wah wah. John starts crying. He goes after to find the cure. First, he kills his uncle. Now, now what you're gonna want to do here to kill your uncle is you're not gonna want to shoot him. It says put him out of his what misery. What the hell you've been drinking? Did you catch that? Did you, did you catch that? Always you put your gun this away. On yourself. Always go back to fist. Never mind, we're gonna leave that there. This is your cards right. She actually comes back to life. I can't believe I had to kill that poor man. Unfortunately, for the purpose of this video, I'm not going to do that. Well, if uh, you'll check the previous video, we show a glitch of how to do it. Okay. Sure. Oh. Abigail. Oh. Abigail. I don't feel so great. Jack, get out here now! Oh, good lord, what's happened? Mama, careful, boy. Mama. That would really suck. That would. You know, betrayal. I'm just gonna turn it off. Just for sound purposes. Mm -hmm. uh, stay right there, the pair of you. Don't make me no widower now. I, th I think it's interesting that he walked and then ran. Now pause, now pause, please. I just want you to notice that that in fact is not rope, it is twine. Ooh. Intertangled. That's a big, oh. big factor. Big factor. That. That's that's very nice. Now see, this game is a lot different than most zombie games in in the fact that these are more like these are more like um what was that Will Ferrell movie? Not Will Ferrell. <laughs> Will Smith. What was that Will Smith movie? I am Legend. I am Legend. I am Legend. I am Robot. I'm... No, I am Legend. In okay. Which they're more like vampire zombies. That's kind of the case here. They kind of bite each other's necks, and then they become zombies shortly after. It's not like a you died, now come back to life type thing. I agree. Yeah. I feel like Robert Pattinson would be very pleased. He actually looks strikingly similar the, to Taylor Lautner. The, the anus hole? Is that what no, just, just the Oh, the fit. Okay. Taylor Lautner. Wow. That's graphics. High quality. Very great. I right. feel like I've, I feel like I can actually touch that freckle. That's that's strange. Not... Notice the twine? The twine, the twine. Did you see it? Did you see it? Okay, it says the last, so that's not what you're gonna do. You're gonna bring out your fists. You're obviously gonna fist it. See, the main thing about the main thing about this game is you never do what they tell you. You always do the opposite. Because if you do what they tell you, you will die. So we bring out our fists, get ready, we look her in the face, and we punch her. Just punch her. Just punch. Now you're Don't worry. You're afraid you're gonna die. You're just gonna push. You're gonna push, and then you're gonna run. And then you bring out your lasso because at this point she, her, her shields are weakened. She's ready. You gotta pull her in. No, you don't. Actually, you just do this. Let it go. It's like it's like a teaser. Yes. And then you finally, yeah. There you go. Same thing with the boy. Bring out your fists. Punch him a couple times. Knock him around. I'm gonna actually sprint into him. Come on. That was nice. And then push, push. Is, now, 
this isn't really a fair demonstration because Jack has been working out recently. It just doesn't tell you that the video game. Uh, His name is John, but no, it's, it's Jack. It's John Marston. Right, that's what I said. Oh, okay. So there you see uh, Jack. Oh, that Jack. Yeah. Blah, 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 creepy family, I'm gonna go find you here. Classic zombie family situation. Classic! Just from the days of old. I'm not sure why I want to have a See, at this point, I would already be skeptical, because zombies are coming after his family. Let's find me a doctor in town. Well, I mean, I'm sorry, I don't really know where else you would find a Can doctor. Can you pause it real quick? Oh, oh, it's too late. Too late. Um, it's... I was going to show you a gazebo. Oh. Like, you know the gazebo, the, uh, where the sniper is? Now the controls are very similar to Red Dead Redemption Regular Edition. The only, the only difference is you always want to kill your horse. Because the first horse is always infected. See those bats? Those bats are actually spawned. Yeah, they actually, that's, they bit your horse. They're spawn of Lucifer, and the first horse you call is always infected. It's true, because I remember the first time I played this game, that I got on my horse, and about like half a mile run in, he just, he just bucked me off and bit me while I was down. Now, you're probably getting impatient at this point, saying, why isn't my horse coming? Because you just killed the Satan spawn. He's actually intervening now, with the gods see, to send you a this regular is, this is G. That's where God is looking down, and he's actually waiting for you to make your move. So that way you can have another horse. It's kind of like a reward system. Yeah, yeah, yeah. very much so. That's a it's, a, it's a lot like um, it's a lot like God of War in a lot of ways. Yeah. Now, once you get up this mountain, you'll be able to see um, one of the biggest glitches in the game. I'll point that out whenever actually, we get there. Actually, what you want to do is once you get to the top of this mountain, you want to whistle because your voice actually carries farther from the top of the hill. If you little just... known, little known fact. Yeah. That that is. Jump over this fence. Wow. That that. <laughs> Seems like he was a hurdler in his days. Hmm? Yeah. What about that? Now, if you notice... See, now my voice carried enough for the regular horse to come find me. Now, if you could just stop moving after you get on your horse for a second, I'd like to sh show a glitch. Um, okay. Fair enough. See, now you want to get on your horse. But you want to make sure he's running away from you, because that means he's healthy. Okay. Now, if you'll just... That, okay. A little bit more. A little bit more? Yeah, a little bit more. A little bit more. Now look up... No, no, not that far off. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, right here. Right. If you can, yes, the top of that mountain. It looks a lot like Mount Mordor. It, looks, that's what it is. Okay. Oh! So once you get there, it'll be all the Orkai there. And beat Star. Oh! Beat now what you're gonna do is, there's actually- That explains the zombies. That's, it's, it's an underground tunnel. Now if you go this way a little bit. Wait, if I go this way? Yeah, this way. See that rock right there? Yeah. It's an underground passage. That's the only- Oh my can, goodness. It's an exit. It's the only exit. But you can only enter by the mountain, but you have to climb oh, all the way up it. It's a tricky oh, wow. trail. Tricky trail. You really know your things. I actually have a video on that, uh, about that on YouTube. Jin and Jer. Now, what, you'll notice I'm actually going through the hills and, and over Gelatinous. the fields to Grandma's house we go. Um, but I haven't encountered any zombies yet. That's because at this point in the plot, they're actually hiding them from you in a massive horde. And you need to be prepared for this at all times because it has been known to appear in random locations. I'm gonna give you a hint. They're not in the church. It's it's true. They're not. They're not. Now, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna bring out our double barreled shotgun. If you shoot him right between the eyes, that's a pretty big glitch too. Don't show him. Don't show him. I won't. Show. I won't, I won't. So, yeah. No. Oh, no. Oh, stop. 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 Sweet. Stop. Okay. Yes. Okay. Pythagoras. He's a, uh, he invented the Pythagorean theorem, and uh, he also invented the Python. Cool. Um, so, you're gonna follow your little waypoint to the YouTube. Now, I just wanna, can we just turn around? What's that? T just turn around. Turn that. around. Yes, sir. Uh, if you'd like to see, uh, invade Mexico, can you show, can you show them that? Invade Mexico. Interesting. Interesting take on the zombie See, idea. I like it from Rockstar. See, normally they would be saying things like, God save us, we are going to hell. Instead, Rockstar is on the leading edge, again, of most video games. Saying again, so invade true. Mexico. Very out there. I like it. A lot Tarps, of roofing, shingles, iron. 
That doesn't law. make sense. That's completely false. That's why they are gonna invade Mexico, where it makes Real sense. and hand carts. I, uh huh. Just leave now, the edge on Rockstar's. Now part. this is while he's walking around on the old story. Oh, I'll let you um invade Mexico. Now this is actually the yes. professor from a That's the professor. Game. Yeah. He's um from he, a previous game. Yes. yes. He has a bow tie on. And that's, that's his classic uh, wardrobe. He always has the right side untucked. Unclean? Actually, the, um, the health inspection in this game is terrible. It's, it's one thing, is when you try to find Disgusting! Food, you actually have to... Yeah. Notice, this restaurant's actually very nice, though. Notice the propane leak. That might have been sarcasm on Rockstar's part. That's right. That's not propane. Those are urns. Dead bodies. That's what I said. Oh, I'm pretty sure you said propane. Oh, never mind. Let me adjust the camera here. Okay, back to my Mexico story. They put invade Mexico. It's me. Due to... That's the doctor. It is the doctor. What are you doing here? I thought you went back to Yale. I did. I came back uh, for another round of research. And now all hell is quite literally broken loose. Now, a recurring theme here, hell. Mm -hmm. With the fire, uh -huh. the undead, Smith's face is very sunken. Now, if you'd like to look, he has the sideways glasses showing the stress. Sideways bow tie. What is going on? Yeah. What's up? Yeah. I'm a man of science, a man of great learning. A, a thinker. No, no, no. Can we just pause it real quick? I'm sorry. Um, I'd like to point out that his pockets on the right side. Typical mistake by Ooh. Rockstar. Ooh. That's not. That's not good. Yeah. No. Yeah. See, normally I'm on the rock. Oh. Time has passed. Rockstar again, with the deep blowing minds. Wow. Bakery Street. Tobaccos. Yeah. Man, I'll be honest with you, sir. Fine. I've got a fucking oh. clue. Why that dandy? Well, what, what should we do? Well, I suggest we try to find other survivors, band together, and find a cure. Or fight to the death trying. Well, well that sounds great and all, but, uh, but I, I'm just peachy. But I'm not sure that I'm, I'm not cut out for such shenanigans. Ooh. I was thinking Ooh. more that uh, finding a horse and, and riding back to the civilized north at the speed of knots before writing a paper on the events from the comfort of my study. Now, I'd like to point out that um, he said that he's going to ride his horse. I'll show you. Um, he dies. I'm just going to throw that out there. Uh, false, completely he, false. he didn't kill his first horse. Oh, tricky, tricky. I know, you gotta think about it. I'd also like to point out these britches, not not very popular at this time period. Although the stripes, uh, vertical stripes, do make them look taller. No, 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 the stripes were actually very popular in the 30s, back in uh, John John Olsen's day. Um, uh huh. Popular, popular pants right. back then. But not in the, not in the 10s and 15s, not in the teen years. Nope. When this takes place, supposedly. Just not. Not up to date. No, it's a. Uh, I mean, Rockstar really could have done some research. It's a little bit like Back to the Future, cowboy zombie style. Yeah, if you really. Yeah. Notice it's exactly twelve o'clock oh, all, all the time. time. All the time. Oh, That's very wow. interesting. I'm a scientist. Crazy. Right? I, mean, I, I, I can't do much science if I'm some bloodshot dervish's lunch, can I? That's I'm actually fuck. false. He can. He really could. Your sense of duty is That's very impressive. It's just called professor. lethargic. Lazy, I'm gonna search pathetic the backstreet for survivors. Perhaps staying with you would be safer. I will. Uh, could, could you just wait a sec here, would you please? I, I'm going to... Classic, classic zombie trap in this part. See, whenever there's a suggestion, you there's always... There's a cornhole game going on, right there. Please continue. I'm pretty sure that's a broken street nope, sign. No cornhole for... game. He's looking right at it, he wants to play, that's why he's looking... Fair enough. Okay. Basically, don't listen. You forgot to explain the trap. That nah, well, there's no. The, 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 You'll see wander the trap. down that lonely. Can, can I just point out that is a cowboy boot store? Yes. I never even realized that. That's amazing. It says boots as a sign. I didn't see that. This is the shades, hand. the blind. If you will. Oh. Okay. Yep. I thought that was a new shade. Stay with me, professor. You haven't got a gun. Oh, it's okay. There's no need to worry. Everyone's already dead. <laughs> At this point, I think the professor... Is it? Is he a professor? Yes, sir. Okay. I, I think the professor is just suffering from classic zombie stress. Zombie. He might even be a zombie because he's conversing... Have you seen the mustache? That's a very zombie mustache. That's a zombie's mustache. He, he, very, he very much so resembles James Franco in a way. In a way. I... S mm, I... I kind of see it. I see where you get the basic idea. 